Welcome back to WCCF Tech TV everyone, this is Keith once again, and if you thought this clip from the video that NVIDIA showed revealing their upcoming Titan X Collector's Edition graphics card looked a whole lot like a Star Wars scene, well, turns out you were pretty spot on. Looks like NVIDIA is set to release the Star Wars NVIDIA Titan XP Collector's Edition, Star Wars Edition, which it's quite interesting to see this. Uh, but before we jump into it too heavily, let's look at the specifications of it. This is your typical NVIDIA Titan XP under the hood. So you've got 3840 CUDA cores with a boost clock of 1582. Memory speed rocks in at 11.4 gigabits per second with 12 gigabytes of G5X memory on a 384-bit bus rocking in a 547 gigabytes per second memory bandwidth. So full on, nothing's left out here. So nothing really added. The biggest difference here is the visuals. So they've taken the card and they've completely did a custom shroud for both designs. So you've got your Jedi Order and your Imperial side. So, you know, Pick your side and that's well that's going to be the card that you have so galactic empires uh, features simple lines emulating high-end orderly nature of the resource rich empire whereas the or the rebel alliance is more die cast and a bit worn so it's kind of neat to see a bit of a worn design there so through the course the rest of this video what we're going to do is just kind of let it cycle between one card to the next to show the variations in the design that definitely explains the red and the green uh, theme so it turns out there's no RGB here but there is a red or a green design it's actually kinda neat because the first time we saw the Titan X when it was first announced way back with Maxwell they showed a green fan and that was really neat and kinda like man why didn't they do that but it looks like they found a way to do it and I'm assuming and it's just an assumption here but the screen that goes over the fan actually emits light down onto the fan which is kind of a neat way to do it. it does come in really unique packaging so it's not just your usual package it comes themed whether it's the the rebel alliance or the galactic empire it looks like it's got a nice display case in case you don't want to use it or after you've upgraded later down the road you can still display the card in a nice case so they both showed the Titan X logo down the side and they all have Star Wars on the back plate pre-orders are about to begin tomorrow or November the 8th 2017 and looks like the asking price is $1,200 same as the Titan XP so it's good to see that there's not really a premium on here it's just uh, do you want the regular one or do you want the collector's edition so let us know what you think about this here. Do you think this is a slippery slope here with, uh, we've seen the Assassin's Creed uh, Strix 1080 Ti, but uh, you know, my, maybe next year we'll see a uh, 2060 Mountain Dew edition and a RX 680 Dr. Pepper edition maybe. I don't know. Just let us know what you have to think about that. We'd love to hear your thoughts on it. This has been Keith with WCCF Tech TV and we'll catch you in the next video.